Hello, welcome to this month's edition of the Family Forum. This month we are going to update you on the happenings in third grade. Um, Ms. Lashuk's class has a wonderful student teacher, Katia Carl, and she's going to quickly introduce herself. Hello everyone, my name is Ms. Katia Carl, and I am the student teacher in Ms. Lashuk's class. I am a student at Lancaster Bible College, and I will be here for the next seven weeks till the beginning of March. I'm very excited to be here and get to know each and every one of your students. Thank you. In math, we are currently studying geometry. Last week, we focused on polygons. I am hoping that you heard the wonderful polygon song at home. This week's focus has been on quadrilaterals. Um, if a student can find an example of a quadrilateral at home, that would be great. Take a picture and put it on the Class Dojo Messenger. Miss Carl is starting basic facts with the students this week. She is working on dividing by zero and one. This Friday, there will be a quiz on that. Also, if you have any Moby Max opportunities at home, please have your students sign on so they can get some extra practice at home. Hi, this is Mr. Miller. Just wanted to give you an update on language arts. We've been continuing to work on comprehension skills, such as drawing conclusions and main idea, but you may have noticed that the skills have gotten a bit more challenging. So we're still working on those, but the kids are having to think a little deeper than they ever have before and make some connections to the text that aren't immediately obvious. So my encouragement to you would just be to continue to have your child read at home as often as possible and to realize it doesn't have to be a super long time each day, but consistently reading each day for 15 to 20 minutes will add up over time. So keep it up. It's really important. And also the main other thing I'd like to share with you is that we're working on opinion writings and we're actually going to be doing a district writing assessment soon. But our writings have moved from one paragraph, which students have done up until the beginning of third grade, and now we're working on three paragraphs. So we've added an introduction and a conclusion. If your child would like to review the three paragraph setup, you can actually find a quick video on how to do that over on Class Dojo. I already added a quick note to Class Stories, and you can find the link to the video on YouTube right in the update. I see that uh, several of you have already checked it out, but if you haven't been over to check it out, definitely do that. And you can download the note sheet that students got in class. Currently in social studies, we are studying national symbols, including the Liberty Bell, the American flag, the bald eagle, and the Washington Monument. We are also teaching the third graders to sing two different patriotic songs, including your grand old flag and this land is your land. Please ask your student to sing it at home. You will be pleasantly entertained. You should definitely do that. In science, we are on hiatus to focus on reading skills leading up to the PSSA. That's still a couple months away, but we're going to come back around to it when we have a little more free time to do some more experiments. Miss Carl here again. I hope you enjoyed this short update on what's been happening here in third grade. If you have any comments or questions, please just feel free to contact us either through Class Dojo, email, or phone, uh, whatever would work best for you. Thanks again for listening. We hope you have a wonderful evening.